I am going to show you how to install the new hurricane fan and the carbon uh, fan guard tonight. So, first you're going to remove your stock fan. 2.5 millimeter hex driver. Take out the four screws. Okay. Carefully unplug it. Set it aside. So now we're going to open the new fan and the fan guard. Now there's a spe specific order in which these need to go on. You're going to see in the fan guard there's some aluminum spacers in the screws. You're going to take the fan logo up. You have these small aluminum spacers are going to fit inside these holes in the fan, all four of them. And you're going to see they don't fit all the way down. They're going to rise up above the top of the fan by about a millimeter. You can see that there. And that's supposed to be like that. So we're going to set this on here with the wire pointing out towards the plug. Then you're going to take your carbon fan guard. I'll turn it so that it's looking pretty, facing the right way. And that's going to go on top. And then you're going to install the four screws that have been supplied, the new ones. And it's all going to go on just like this. You might want to put a touch of blue Loctite on these screws since they do thread into aluminum and could vibrate loose, especially on an 8 scale vehicle. You don't want to over tighten these, but a little bit of Loctite will keep them in. So there's that, and then we're going to plug it in. Make sure you get the plug in the right way. If I can get my big fingers to work. There you go. That's all installed, just like that. Make, you got to make sure you have those spacers in underneath the fan guard. And you can see it spins freely. Now we can plug this all in and listen to it fire up because it is it is going to work really, really well. And blow a lot of air and keep your speed control nice and cool. Plug in all our connectors. Okay, okay. And let's listen. There you go. Just like that.